friends, in this problem here, there is a network of 12 resistances which are connected in form of a cube and you have to find the equivalent resistance of the circuit across AB. Now what is AB? AB is the uh, mm, point of opposite diagonals of the cube, right? So let us see, now what does it mean? Here current will enter at A and it will leave the circuit, it will leave the cube at B. So uh, let us see how current is entering at A and it is going to B. Now here there are three possibilities. Now first current will enter at A and it will divide into three parts. The three part, one part is AC, another is AD and another is A. This is the possibility and let us see, let us study how this is reading at B. Now, let me explain one thing. In balance piston bridge, you know that uh, it is based on the uh, method of short circuiting. Method of short circuiting means we will short circuit the point which will be on same potential. For example, uh, as you know the case of balance piston bridge, now this is the case of balance piston bridge. Now here A and B, this point is C and this point is D. Now what we study, in the due to symmetry of the circuit, whatever current is entering at A, it is going through two roots and the two ro roots are symmetrically, electrically symmetrical. So uh, the same current will flow through the two branches as a result the point C and point D will be on same potential. So if point C and point D will be on same potential, now no current will flow through this resistance and this resistance will not receive the circuit. That is, we can short circuit the point C. You can see here, this resistance played no role in resisting the circuit. So here we will short circuit the point C and D. Now the same point will be represented by both the points C and D same potential and how this is connected the equivalent diagram will be equal to here the key this resistance A to C. Now this resistance A to C will be connected here like that and A to D this is connected here like that. Similarly C to B this is connected here and this is connected here. So this will be the equivalent circuit. This will be the equivalent circuit. Right? This will be the equivalent circuit. Right? So, humne, so what we see that the points which are at same potential may be short circuited and this simple uh, this circuit becomes so easy now. So <clears throat> here also we have to study ki, uh, how these resistances are connected when current is entering from A and it is reaching to B. Now let us see, you just see, there are three routes, I am talking for this route AC. Now the current entering through AC, it will divide it into equal part the key. See, you just see CF and CG. CF and CG. Here, now the current will enter into A to C, it will divide it in two parts, CF and CG. And finally it is reaching to B with the help of this route GB and AB with the help of this route you can see how current is entering at A and reaching to B through root AC here the so you just see there is a network of one resistance here and there is a network of four resistances so we can say that here while this is point A and if we talk for this root AC so this current will get, go through this point and it will follow a network of four resistances. This point is C. It will follow a resistance of four resistances. Like and finally it is reaching to this point B. Right? Now this is F and this is G. Here there are certain things. Right? So now what for the branch AD? The current entering to the AD, it, this is also divided into two parts and the same part reaching to B in this manner. 
which has been shown in the figure with blue color. You just see the current entering to AD, here AD, it is divided into two parts. One part from DF and another from DH. So DF and DH and finally F to B and H to B. So F to B and H to B. Finally it is coming to B. So here also this branch will be one resistance, right? And a network of four resistances. This point is D of course and a resistance of, there is a branch of four resistances. And finally it is going to B. Now this is B. This point is B. Right? And in third case, you just see, this is the branch. Current entering from A to E. A to E. This get divided into two parts. And again this part is meeting to B, forming a uh, resistance of four network. So it is like that. This is the point. A to E. Here four resistance. Again it is using to B. So this will get, you will get the similar circuit I am telling. My, I will just erase it. So here there is a resistance of, there is a network of four resistances. Of course this point is D. Right? Similarly, now this is D. This point is G. This point is D. And this is F and H. This point is F and this point is H. So it is using to be in this fashion. Now, if we talk for A, so this is network, again network of four resistances. We have reached to point E. Now here, there are network of four resistances. So here also, one is this, second one is this, here this, and now, if we circuit, if we short circuit this point B, right, so eliminating this, this point will be B, so we just see, you just see all the resistances, all the resistances in which current entering at A and reaching to B, yeah, leaving the uh, uh, circuit at B are a group of three branches which which is has a single resistance connected in series with uh, a network of four resistances in all three branches you will see now this is the fashion of resistance to be connected so what we see here we see that since the circuit is like the all three branches are electrically symmetrical so the same current the current the main current i will be divided here into three equal part i by three here also i by three and here i by three current is divided into three equal part and the points symmetrically located are at same potential like here c d and e here c d and e the point represented by blue color will be on same potential right similarly uh, if we talk if we talk uh, from uh, this side, so H, G and A, this will be on same potential, H, now H, G, F, H, decay, and this will be uh, G, this is H, this will be, this will be G and this will be H, so all these six points will be, decay. you just see this F, G and H. This point also will be on same potential, leaving one resistance from the end. So F, G and H will be same potential and the method is uh, to short circuit the points on same potential. So we will short circuit the point C, D and E and similarly F, G and H. But mind it, the potential of C, D and E is same, potential of F, G and H is also same. but the potential of C and F is not equal. These are, these are at different potential, right? So what we will see, you just uh, replace the circuit by short circuiting the points on same potential, right? So here is the point A, right? Here is the point A where current is reaching. 
Now this point C, D and E. This will be on the same potential. So this is the point C, D and E. This will be a same potential. Similarly, the point F, G and H will be on the same potential. This point F, G and H. This will also be on same potential. And finally, this is the point B. Right? Finally, this is the point B. We are currently leaving the circuit. This point is B. Right? Now, just you, you, <coughs> you see how these resistances are connected. From A to C, from A to C, this resistance is there. So from A to C, you make that resistance. This is the resistance from A to C, here. Now from A to D, there is one resistance. Now this point is A, this point is D. So here is second resistance, A to D, this one. Now from A to E, this point is also E. So A to E, there is one resistance here. So now this. AC, AD and AE are connected in this way, right? Similarly, from C point, this is the point C, CF and CG, there are two resistances. Now CF and CG, F and G are same point, so here there are two resistances. CF and, CF and CG, this is the two resistances, right? Again, from D, df and dh you see f and h is also this point so df and dh these two resistances df and dh right now from e if you will see it from e what is there here from e now there are eg and eh here EG and EH. Now this point is E, this point is E. So EG, EG and EH. G and H are same point. So here this is EG and this is EH. So all these six resistances are connected in this person. Now what for F to B? This is F and this is B. So this is F to B. This resistance. Now G to B, G to B. This is the, this resistance. And finally, H to B, this will be the, this resistance. So this is the uh, equivalent circuit of this cube when current is entering at A and reaching at B. So of course, this will be how much? If resistance of uh, each arm is small r, small r, resistance of each arm is small r, then what will be? This all three are parallel. So this will be r by three. Now the all six are in parallel, so this will be R by six, and all the three are in parallel, so R by three again. So now this R by three in series with R by C in series with R by uh, three. So what will be equivalent resistance across AB? This will be R by three plus R by six plus R by three, and if we will take LCM here, it is six. Now this is two R plus R. This is 2R plus R plus 2R and finally we have, it is equal to how much? 5R by 6. This is 5R by 6. So equivalent resistance of this circuit, equivalent resistance of this answer is equal to how much? RAB will be equal to here, RAB will be equal to 5 by 6R. Right? This will be the answer. Okay. Thank you.